<laughs> the Zelda music, like, against that. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty great. God, why? Shut up, dude. <laughs> oh! Is this where I'm at? I think I was just trying to get some squares uncovered, I think. Mm-hmm. But I could do this stupid dungeon thing. What do you think, Billy? Oh. Welcome back to Wind Witch. We haven't played this game in a fucking hot minute here. I want candy. You want... Well, you got your candy. You better clean that up. I will. Yep. <laughs> Alright, we're just going to go adventuring for a little bit, because we're... Um... Not, like, short on time, but we don't have, like, a ton of it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, on this earth. True. <laughs> oh, I need to get... Oh, hold on. You fucker. You fucker. You fucker. You fucker. You fucker. Did you go to the water temple? Well, I was just... I, I can right now. I don't want to go to the water temple, though. Why? Because the water temple is the best temple? Yeah, In every single... Yeah, it's fucking fine. It's fine. Like, it's not that bad. Everyone knows the water temple's the worst temple. It is the worst one, but shut up, dude. Here you go. Give me the thing. Let's do this. Is that the nut, the peanut butter? Or just regular? I mean, shit, come on, let's go, bro. It's, uh, I want to be with you. Oh, the Mr. Big, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah, but it, it wasn't the peanut butter. Oh, yeah, that's the Mr. Rick, and then you got the O'Henry. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. All right. Well, we're going this way. We're going down this way. We're going to go past the private oasis. Now, it's been a little bit since I played this game. I don't remember a lot of the stuff. I've actually been playing Twilight Princess a little bit, and that game is pretty good. I like that game. Oh, I love Minda. Yeah, me too. Oh, I don't want to fuck her. <laughs> Only in the imp form, though. Mm -hmm. Not mm -hmm. in her human form. At the mm -hmm. end. everybody, everybody forgets about that. But mm -hmm. no, like, there's a good reason for it. Is because the imp form is way better. Have you seen that ash? Yes, I have plenty of times. You look at it throughout most of uh, Twilight Princess. So fucking hot. That game was pretty good. I liked that game quite a bit. Yeah. It kind of like. Again, with, like, every Zelda game, it falls under, like, the same bullshit as, like, every other Zelda game, though. <laughs> like, even in this one, in a sense. Like, Hyrule is always, like, under darkness or, like, underwater or in the Shadow Realm or something. Like, or there's some calamity happening. Yeah, like, it, like, every single game has that. Well... Why would they uh, they have you play it if uh, there's no like problem? No, I know that, but I mean it's just like, why can't we ever be in high rule like when it's like you know having a good day? Having a good day. I mean, I guess Ocarina of Time is kind of like that, I guess. Oh, huh. but I don't know. I, that's all I'm saying. It's just like, like the premise of like that is always present in these games where it's like it's in Twilight or it's surrounded in the darkness or whatever you know that's all i'm getting at really it's um link to the past when you're in the uh you know in the light realm everything's great when you're playing uh ocarina of time everything's great until you get to you know at old age yeah I know that, like, isn't there an actual canon to the stories? I'm sure there is, but, like, who fucking cares? <laughs> yeah, I need some money for the auction, alright? Now, this island I know I can't go on yet, because it's the ice one. But we're gonna uncover it. Do I need to get all the circles, or the squares, rather? No, but I'm gonna, all right? Because then once it's done, it's done. And you never have to do it again. And I never have to do it again. Exactly. I want candy. 
So I think it would be beneficial if I went into the water temple. I think that might be where we get the bow and arrow. So that it's would, been so fucking long. I I'm do not remember pretty what sure, is. Pretty sure that's where we get it. That might actually be useful if only for the fact that um, if I come across uh, the Cyclos dude, I can get the... Uh, oops. I can get the um, teleport ability. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The warping ability. So I wonder if maybe I should do that. Uh, hey, bitch, Graves. I just like to know the... I just like to have the map because it's like... There's certain things where you want to go and do them and get yeah. them and whatever, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't go on this island anyway. Shut up. I think he tells you where to get the item that you need, but it's like I can't even go. I don't have the bone arrow. Fuck. I keep hitting the wrong button. <sighs> Billy, what do you think? What do you think? About? Should I go? I'm pretty sure we get the bow and arrow. I told you where to go in the first place. The water temple? Yeah. Okay. Well, then maybe I should do that, because then I can get the arrows. Yeah, fuck it. You know what? Okay. All right. Here's what we're going to do. We'll do the water temple. That's everybody's favorite fucking temple. And uh, as a result of that, we'll get the arrows, and then I'll start doing all the, the, the squares, because then I can get the warp ability. Yeah. See, should have listened to me at the first I know. Oh, okay, well, whatever. We got we got some squares uncovered, so whatever. Shut up, dude. And it's clear again. Oh, fuck yeah, that's good. <laughs> you ever just drink water? Yeah. It's like the fucking best, dude. It's like it sustains me. H, two... Oh my god, it's delicious. H2OMG poutine. Mm, I haven't been there. I haven't either. And you live here in America. I live in Canada. I don't know if that's true. Well, we'll just have to ask Melissa, the resident Canadian down. When are you going to get the red seal? We don't get it in this one. Uh, uh, what? You're telling me that that is only if you have the um, the Wii U version. The Wii U version. Yeah. Yep. That's just, we're sitting here waiting. That's Charlotte. I know this was like a big point of controversy when this game originally came out. Was like the whole sailing element of it. But I'm like, I think it's pretty cool. Like, I wish that there was more for you to do while it's going on, but... Yeah. You know. I, I would have liked, you know, maybe some bigger storms. Maybe you actually yeah. have to pilot it. Yeah, right. Like in Sea of Thieves. Yeah, something different, yeah. There's a big storm. Your place, your thing starts flooding. And if it gets really bad, your boat will start breaking holes into it. Yeah. Then you gotta patch them up and still drive the thing. Yeah, but look, Billy, every time it goes up and down, it just floods anyway. You see that? Yeah, I see it. There's water in your fucking feet, and then it's gone. And then, and then, and then. Come on, Nintendo. You were better than that. <laughs> were. You're no longer good. You know Nintendo what? died you, off a long time ago. You know what? I think a lot of people are getting to that point, too. Which is funny. And they're, they're so anti-consumer now, so... Oh, yeah, totally. Absolutely. They, they have not progressed into the future of how gaming is, which sometimes good, sometimes bad. Like, Nintendo's always done their own thing, which I think is kind of what makes them cool. Yeah. But, like, also... There are, they've only done their one thing. Yeah. Like they and, <laughs> you know, sometimes it's good to actually follow the crowd, like, with customer relations and, you know... Yeah. Yeah. That kind of shit. Yep. I agree. Yeah, they've done, they've done a pretty bad job with that. Um, recently I know that's been a big thing for them is I don't know like the services and shit that they have are just is just not very good alrighty let's do this freaking uh oops I don't know hey, 
<laughs> Whoopsie poopsie. I do like the combat in this game. Yeah, the combat in this game is <coughs> pretty fun. I don't I like it's funny because it's like in the other um It's simple yet not. Zelda games like Breath of the Wild it kinda sucks. Like it's yeah. not and I'm not saying that the combat's bad, it's just very undercooked for how rest of the game like the rest of the game is. Mm-hmm. Should have flipped it. <sighs> sure. Fuck. Sure. Oh my god. Oh. I don't even remember what's in here. Probably a small key or something. A small key or some gems. <gasps> oh my god. Um, the rubies, dude. Uh, it's pronounced ah! ruby. It's pronounced rubies. The Russians use these. <laughs> oh, at least it's better than just a key. You actually yeah. can see the map now. So Billy, so Billy, so Billy, you've been watching the the Better Call of the Sauls. A little bit, yeah. I I'm like season two. Season two. Yeah. What is it? Five seasons. Uh, I believe so. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe six, I forget. Yeah, I can't remember. Um, I've been mainly watching The Lord of the Rings. The Rings of Power? Yeah. How's that? Terrible? Uh, actually, pretty good. Overall, I like it. You would, you fucking nerd. Like, it's not perfect by any means necessary. Yeah. But overall, it's not so bad. Okay, well, that's good. Like, you know, it's got some dumb moments and stuff like that. Oh, what series does it? Yeah. But uh, overall, I would say at least it's pretty. I was not expecting some things. Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, total spoilers, but, um. Oh, in like the third episode. Oh. In like the third episode, uh, they let a warg out. Okay. And, um. Oh, damn it. It's probably not even worth whatever's in here. <laughs> probably not. They let a warg out. And, like, this elf guy is gonna be fighting it. And then, like, some humans uh -huh. show up. And they're like, ah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get you with a spear. And then the warg just fucking, like, rips into their belly and rips it out. Oh. Like Game of Thrones esque, um, gore. Yeah, gore. And I'm like, holy shit! Was not expecting that. Then like another person tries running, and then the war grabs him, and rips him apart, and just <laughs> there's blood and everything. I'm like, this is not what I was expecting from uh, this Lord of the Rings. Is not Lord of the Rings worthy. The only thing I was thinking from Lord of the Rings was going to be orc blood. Yeah, like sometimes like they have like the obligatory like scar on somebody's face or something. Yeah, but like you don't really see blood. No. Especially none of the good guys. Skilly willy dee. Scooter boo. Wow. Face water run into that. <laughs> so yeah, overall not too bad. <clears throat> Melissa and I watched The Sauls. Uh, the Sauls good we liked, we liked it. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. If I had to pick between um, Grover Cleveland and Teddy Roosevelt, no. If I had to pick between uh, fucking Saul or Breaking Bad, I'd honestly say they're pretty much about even. Yeah, I hear it's uh, quite good. It's like not. I wouldn't say it's any better or any worse. It's a pretty much like on the same level. <laughs> the first season of Better Call Saul was a little. A little slow. Yeah, a little slow. Oh, they got enough shit that they gotta like build up, I guess. I don't yeah, know. but it's gotten better because it just seemed a little more cheesy, kind of campy like feeling. Sort of. But then it got better. Yeah. Season two was good. Skidoosh. Skidoodle Oh. <coughs> 
don't even like specifically remember what I'm supposed to do for this temple. I'm just kind of going. Yeah, the, that's kind of what all of these temples are. There's not that much thought in them you have to put. Yeah. You just have to remember that you have to continue moving forward. So obviously I'm like, I gotta go that way, but I'm gonna go this way first. Yeah. Because we can blow open these. Use your cannon. Use your cannon, I can blow open the walls. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Like, they could have done so much better, like, with that little mechanic right there. You could have had ship battles. I mean, you can but battle. You can you battle ships. Really but battle not, ships. Yeah, not like, it's not that, like, <clears throat> well developed or anything. I get that they didn't want to, I don't know. Like, I, I, I suppose at the time frame, there's only too much, like, so much that they could have done anyway, but, like, I don't know. Like, I know people really didn't like the style of this game. I, I know, yeah, when it first came out, and then now people love it. So yeah. it's like, I don't know. So I think is not real Zelda. Yeah, I and just, I just get, was. I just get tired of like the same shit with Zelda. It's yeah. really just my problem with it. Like they just do the same fucking like basic idea every time. <laughs> yep, just uh, slightly different puzzles. Sometimes, yeah, not even different. But it's got the same aesthetics. It's got the same lore and mythos. Yeah, like everything about it is the same. I think it's funny how they're doing they're doing Breath of the Wild 2 they've already announced it and it's like the same like trailer as like uh, Skyward Sword oh. <laughs> where he's like falling through the sky and shit like that falling around at the speed of sky falling around at the speed of scrounge I got blazes on a scrub lap deem blow Taylor, which, uh, which song do you like better? Don't Fear the Reaper or Man in the Box? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. I'm your man with I think box. Man in the Box is a little bit more fun than Don't Fear the Reaper. Is it because he goes, Yeah. yeah. I, I forgot what that guy's name is, but he's a really good singer. <laughs> Jesus Christ! And now you can go get fucked. Can you plug my butt? But then the other one's got Christopher Wacken. Not in the fucking recorded version. <laughs> no. What are you talking about? I uh, need more cowbell. I can't do a Christopher well, Walken. I only got. I got the fever. <sighs> and the only description uh, is more cowbell. Please, please give me the cowbell. I need it. My family's gonna die. <laughs> unless there's more cowbell. I don't know. Like, don't fear the reaper is good too. But I think yeah. I don't know. Like, the chorus of "Don't Fear the Reaper" is like not as memorable. It's made in the box. Because they've got that kind of like, you know, more subdued delivery of the vocal, you know? Jesus, don't fear the rapper. Don't do the wind or the sun or the rain. We I like how dark it gets kind of in the middle section, though. That yeah, it does. Cool. Like, it gets kind of eerie and spooky. That, that one, like, transforms a lot. Yeah. Which is nice. Um, Man in the Box is just more like pump you up though. More anthemic. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, they're both good. I don't really know if I'd hard say that I think one is that much better than the other. I was never a huge Alice in Chains fan to begin with. Like, I think they're a great band. They definitely got some hits. I'd like to hit it or quit it. You know what I'm saying? I guess. I don't know. Are you aware of what I am saying? Can you comprehend what I am saying? Because if you can't, then you shan't. Tell me what I can do to make you understand that I want a man who has a plan. Want a man. (coughs) Sorry, I had to come. (coughs) 
<coughs> well, am I boring you right now? Yes. <laughs> it's not my fault. No, it's just the water temple. I, you know, I can't help it. But I gotta play chess, because chess is important to me, too. Yeah. I'm sorry, what? Cow Quigley. Cow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you cow. <laughs> That's funny that you still see him, because I, I haven't seen him in a long time. Oh, Not that he would remember who I am anyway. Yeah, yeah I say, oh, yeah, I was hanging out with Taylor. He said, who? Like, Taylor B B Battery. Who? And he's like, who? Yeah, like, him and I weren't really friends. But. Yeah. But yeah, it was good. You know, I work with him, and that's kind of why I see him. God, I hate this. I also, shit. you know, I see him. This shit right here stinks. It stinks like butt cheeks. Well, it's like, why do I have to go so slow to get to the next part Can't here? Can't you open up your thing? Yeah, but there's no wind in here. I'll do it anyway. I'm like almost there. There's no point. Yeah, it See how much faster you went? Doesn't do anything. <laughs> you weren't even trying, Taylor. You were just fucking sitting there. Of course, the wind uh, is not gonna pick up. I should just use the um, the deku leaf to fucking blow wind into it. I believe it's pronounced dipu. I believe it's pronounced dequa. Dequa. It's like uh, what you call uh, the 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 gratuito, the gratua. I don't know what you're talking about. Gretchen. Gretwat? Yeah, Gretois. It's French for the shit. <laughs> Gretois. <laughs> the shit. <laughs> I've never heard anybody refer to Gretchen as the shit. <laughs> that would be really funny if people said that. <laughs> yeah, you just go south on the shit. <laughs> All right, you know where the shit is? You gotta take the shit. <laughs> you're gonna take it south for about 15 miles and then you get to 23 and shit. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Somebody would call it that too, though. <laughs> Somebody like Pat Finnerty would call it that. Who the fuck is Pat Finnerty? He's the guy that did the Kravitz Bowl. I was just telling you. About oh, yeah, that. that's right. <laughs> Immediately forgot his name. <laughs> Pat Finnerty would call it the shit. I'm gonna do this uh, review on this this fucking road. It's pronounced "grash it" in in the common tongue. Gatois, if you're French, or as the uh, the astute of you might say, the shit. <laughs> Locals call it the shit. Now I only have water coming out of my ears. How does That's this? I'm so mad. How is this place not getting completely flooded? That doesn't make any There's sense. There's a drainage system. Well, yeah, but like, why? That uh, backs up a lot. Oh, okay. Well, next time I'm a chaps, we'll not back it up. Back it up. <laughs>